Hello, this is Jay from Cucumber Shop. We are today looking at some greenhouse cucumber varieties. Really some cucumber melon varieties because that's what I like to specialize in. Um, this one has some female flowers on there. You can tell that by the, the bottom here. And then here's a male flower that does not have that bottom part. Notice the difference. Um, and speaking of female flowers, this variety has female flowers that also have male parts. So it has both the pollen and the non-pollen there. Um, so these are hermaphrodite flowers. They have both male and female parts. And uh, I always forget whether it's called anthers or stamen or whatever. There's a really good example of one right there. It has both parts. Um, so these are a carousello variety. Cucumis anguria. And this is a... Uh, snake melon variety, uh, Cucumis flexuous. You can see here, these female flowers are just regular, and then you have the male flowers with the pollen. Speaking of pollen, what I generally do, well, let's just show this to you, so I get one of these flowers. I pull uh, them back and then I will pollinate by going around the outside of the flower right there and that's how I pollinate the flowers. Um, it's near the end of the season, it's uh, late September and because of that we're getting disease from outside, we're getting some um, powdery mildew and some other fungal disease. I'm not sure exactly what this is, but it's causing holes. This is not an insect. Well, it could be. Uh, yeah, I guess they are insects. In any case, um, getting some little insects making holes in there. Um, the reason I could tell that they were bugs there's some poop right there, or frass. Caterpillar poop's called frass, but in any case, uh, hopefully um, these plants will live long enough to produce some fruit, and so I can see what they look like, and uh, that's sometimes what I do with my greenhouse, is just do some experimental stuff, find out what things are. If you have any questions, just let me know. Again, this is Jay from Cucumber Shop. Take care. And happy garden.